So what inspires love? Others love versus self love. And uh, a lot of these points come from Tracy Porterfield. So basically number one is practice gratitude. You know, what's going right in your life versus thinking about what's going wrong in your life. Right? If you've got like whatever issues that are not really bigger issues or problems, then you should be fine. You know, like staying clean and keeping your stuff organized. <laughs> but basically what I'm saying, by the way, this is coffee. So what I'm saying is, you know, you have to be able to recognize that, like take a moment in your day to recognize stuff like that so that you can uh, feel better, you know, throughout your day and not jump to so many uh, obstacles in terms of like how you interact with other people. All right, um, number two is appreciate your past and unblock any blocks that are with you, you know. Um, in order to be a relatively well-adjusted person, you wanna have as little baggage with you as possible. And so you should do everything to make it like that, um, but not in an inhumane fashion. Um, just because something stops doesn't mean that it has to be a, a bad problem. It just can mean it's something that had to be put to the side, okay? Um, oh, making repetitions become habits. So basically by training yourself, you know, making repetitions, doing the same thing every day, drinking a cup of coffee every day, brushing your teeth, hopefully, hopefully every day, right? All of that, that allows you to think of more and in bigger capacities, like, you know, including different scenarios within what you're doing during the day versus uh, wasting thought on it. Okay, three is focus on the feel good. Um, I kind of agree with this one. I feel like feel good is subjective for every different person. So you can't even say that like for like in a block for a mass amount of individuals because sometimes the feel good is what gets someone in trouble. You know, it depends on who the audience is and how you express that to that audience. So if you've got audience of guys versus the audience of girls versus audience of other, you know, it, it literally has to be expressed specifically. Um, anyway, <laughs> give yourself treats. Now this one I do, this one is something I do. And so basically, um, I have to go with whatever budget I have. Um, and I always have someone helping out and supplementing, you know, in terms of moving forward but it's crazy because i see it like that even though it's business or monetary it's not uh it's not like personal so it's kind of like okay so this is this is growth like this is an interesting way to go and um so far it's been fantastic because there's been no backlash from anything that i've ever had to involve myself with so um it's really just smooth um a smooth ascent uh, it took a little bit longer than, you know, would be a more traditional route, which is, you know, becoming a manager or any of these other things. But there's nothing wrong with being a manager. Like, it's just a, a fair amount of work and you're always thinking about, you know, your brand. So you become a brand or a part of a brand when you become a manager. Um, okay, so anyway, give yourself treats, like I said. Like, if I'm eating nothing but green vegetables all week, and I want to have a brownie, and then I'm like, yeah, I could do that because I I earned it. Versus it being, it's it's another mental thing, right? Um, so birds of a feather, you know, you have to choose wisely about who is on your right and your left because if you don't, then you put yourself in a position where it's uncomfortable, you know, and. Uh, for one one party or another party. So you just need to make sure that you have your thoughts in order of who you wanna be. Cause who you wanna be is effect effectively gonna dictate who's around you. Um, number five, commit to positive improvements. I mean, that's, a, that's an ob obvious one, but I guess not everybody thinks that's obvious. You know, con commit to positive improvements. That literally means like 
taking a part of your life like and and dedicating it to always being better than the day before what come on now that 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 is the move it's like okay well um you know it it's positive like that but and, but of course you want to put this into yourself as well like putting it out into your sides of like work and stuff like that is good too but you want to make sure that you remember to always be better than you were the day before um anyway help others right and the sooner you give okay that was a little much but basically uh you want to make sure that your your heart is always in the effort of helping another person versus helping yourself because you are going to be taken care of by being a good Samaritan, so to speak, <laughs> by being, you know, a good person, because even if it's not immediately, it's always something that's going to be remembered and put back, you know, in a scenario that it can come and make your life better. So with that, that's this video. I've got a few videos I got to do. So if you're enjoying it, please like, subscribe and um, yeah, share if you want to. But, you know, it's, it's more personal, so you, you can do whatever you want. Peace.